Hi, welcome back to Learn It or Return It with Clarice or Mommy and Lydia. Today we're going to be talking about the game Zero. It is 15 to 20 minutes approximately, um, ages 8 and up, and 2 to 8 players. Yep, it's by Calliope. Calliope. Calliope Games. That's much better. All right, Lydia, why don't you open it up? Okay. Okay, so. So it comes with this little, it's almost like rice paper, but it's very, I'm not really sure. I guess it's just for appearances. It's very flowy. I'm just going to put it in the lid. Comes with the rules and this neat little open up rule part there. So we have the board, which I'll just open up and show you the picture on it. It's a big bird. I want to make sure I have it the right way. The head's there. Or a phoenix, possibly. Oh no, it's a dragon, you silly. Isn't uh, it a dragon? It doesn't look like a dragon. Where's the head? Oh no, it is a bird. It looks almost like a, yeah, it's almost like a peacock. Here, here you go. Let's put this down. So the one thing to just show you, I'm going to show you a little bit. Um, so around the board, there, sorry, Lydia. There's a white little <laughs> notch. Block here. It's fine. You see around, uh, there are little white notches all around, and those are the starting paths to lead into the game. So put this down and we'll show the rest of the components here. Here. Sorry. Let me just grab. So it comes with 35 game tiles. These are the game tiles. They're cute little. Yeah. They show little paths that we're going to use throughout the game. So a bunch of, a lot of different ones. And then the other different one, the one different one is the dragon tile. This would be used for uh, for games of three or more players. So it's just supposed to uh, be held by the person uh, or by a person in that game to, it's a, what is it, a placeholder for, uh, for taking new tiles when they become available. So, oops, excuse me. And then there are eight little, um, they're Plastic little, little meeples. No, they're markers. Markers with a little... The dragon. Dragon on them. Yeah, and they're, they're fairly nice quality, too. And they're pretty nice little, little markers. And they come in eight different colors. Yeah. Okay, so let's just show you how this goes. It's, it's a fairly easy setup. As you can see, we just place the board. Uh, just tuck this game. Maybe move the board off over here, just like that. Uh, so we'll choose one color each. So I'm going to start with mustard yellow. And I'm going to start with black. Yeah, and we'll take the other ones and put them back in the game, in the game box. Right there. Okay, we don't need the dragon tile because, as you can see, it's just the two of us today. So we'll throw that in there. And then you take your player and put it on one of the uh, white notches here. We're going to take all the tiles and we're going to just mix them up. Okay, and I'll choose my starting spot. So we'll just choose, just choose about there. So what we do for the initials, uh, so the beginning here, is we're going to start with three each. You can look at your own, but you don't look at the other person's. And then we'll just put the pile, let's move this a little this bit. This is my hand. Oh. So we'll put our pile right in the center as soon as Lydia comes back. Okay, so the goal of the game here is you want to be the last one standing on the board. And the way to do that is you're going to keep giving you, yourself little paths that you're going to keep following throughout. And you're hoping that the other person is going to be stuck with a card in the end that, or a tile that they're going to end up going off the board. Or you'll place one as soon as you become kind of connected, that will you'll start with moving yourself, and then it'll send the other person off. So let's just show you how it goes. 
So the first thing we're going to do on a turn is we're going to look at our cards or tiles and we're going to choose one that we're going to place in front of our own character. Okay, so Lydia will maybe start. The second thing we're going to do is we're going to take a, a tile to replace in our hand. So we'll always have three. And then, so the first one, yeah, choose one. Second, you're going to place your tile that you've chosen. Then you're going to move your little person along. Right? Yep. And at the end of your turn, you're going to pick up another. So Lydia's moved her little person along. Yep. So let me see what I can do. Now, the, um, there's one thing to note. So I'm just going to move that along. So I've reached there. Uh, so you cannot intentionally give yourself a tile that will push you off the board. Um, unless at the very end, you have no choice. So sometimes you'll have toward the end of the game, you'll have a tile, you'll have three choices, right? And every which, you know, every which angle uh, you try and you have no choice and then you lose. So anyway, so, so it's your turn. So she's going to place. So you're going to keep following. You're going to place your tile any, any direction and then you have to follow your path. So, and then you grab a tile. Just show you a couple more moves here. Oh, that would actually push me off the board. So we'll do this one. So this one will take me right over there. Okay. It'll turn me around and put me right here. So the one thing I like about this game is that it's it's fairly simple, but it also challenges you because you have to you have to be ahead of it. You have to look at you know, it's not just where you're going right now, it's where as soon as you get more on here, it's going to take you further down and it could lead you right off the board and then you're done. Um, and you're wanting to plan ahead of the other person too, because if let's say you join before the other person's path, you could actually lead them right off, which is, <laughs> I kind of want to do that. So let me just do this. It's the short path right now. Is there anything you want to say about the game? Um, I like the tiles and the little um, characters part of the game. I also like the how they did the game board. It's a very pretty board. Yeah, and it's so simple. And it and like after dinner, before bed, it's it's a pretty pretty fast game. Uh, let's see where I can put that right there. So as you can see, we're, we're starting to get a little closer to each other's paths. Alright. Just getting a little closer. Just have to make sure they line up. There we go. Uh, getting a little closer. I'm trying to approach your, your area so that... <laughs> you can go down my path? Yeah, I like to travel down your path. Okay, let's see where I can go. Now, this is where it's going to be a little tricky. Uh, or, well, maybe not. Go up here. So soon, we won't have very many choices. We'll see. Where did you start? Right there. No, it's right there. Oops, sorry. I don't know why I was trying to grab more. I was really excited to get more. <laughs> Alright, so this one, I'm right at the edge here, I'm looping around, oh, the little jumper there. Hey, I'm right here now. Yeah. And this one. Okay. It's like a little roller coaster ride. Yeah. Start all the way down here, you go round, 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 and then you end up here. And you just keep looping. Yeah. Okay. Let's do that again. Oh, just go all the way down there. Oh my. <laughs> We're getting very far, Mama. Let's see where you're going. Oh, oh <laughs> she's, she's just eliminated. I'm seeing where Maybe they, you want to change that. I'm going to see my other cards. And there can only be one survivor here. On this path, yeah, that. So, yeah, you get to this point where 
almost everyone will lead you off the path. Except for one. <laughs> yeah. And... Oh my goodness. It's starting to get hard. Yeah. Ooh, the one boogity. Oh. Okay. Um... <laughs> Yeah, it just leads you right off. Oh, that one's a bit better. No, it was right here. Oh, I went to the one next to it. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Now I'm at a tricky spot here. Where? I don't think. That one's a little better. <laughs> so you just keep playing again until there is an elimination, which is pretty yeah. darn fast. So I have these cards here. And I'm right here, right against the edge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're done, aren't you? Wait, you're done. Oh no, you're almost done. I almost, I was almost done. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, that one. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> you're done. So stressful. <laughs> you're done. Oh no. No. To go up and around. <laughs> right. Okay. I'm gonna show you just just how we finish this. If you will. You're done. <laughs> I need mean, to see. Yep, you're finished. I'm done. <laughs> yeah. So um, there are a few expansions. I. <laughs> she's done. <laughs> I'm um, done. Some expansions, but. It, I read a lot of reviews that people said that they're unnecessary, and the game is actually pretty nice as, as it is. So anyway, the game is done. Lydia lost. But anyway, so that's the game, and uh, thank you so much for <laughs> watching. You. And I hope you'll subscribe and check out our other videos, and hope you like our video too. Thank you. <laughs> bye. Right, thanks. Okay, bye-bye.